Hey guys, welcome to Slide Hunt with the video tutorial on data structures. To get the complete series of data structure video, please subscribe this channel. In our previous tutorial, we learned about breadth first traversal or level order traversal. Now, in this tutorial, we will learn about depth first traversal. Depth first traversal is of three types pre order, in order, and post order. Here I draw a binary tree and all the nodes are filled with character values. In depth first traversal, if we go in one direction, we visit all the nodes in their direction and then go to the other direction. For example, if we go to the left subtree of A, we visit all the nodes of the left subtree. After that, we visit to the right subtree. Visiting means reading the values of the nodes. Traversing a binary tree means visiting the root, visiting the left subtree, and visiting the right subtree. But order is different for different traversals. For pre-order traversal, first we visit the root, then left subtree, and then right subtree. In case of in order, first we visit the left subtree, then root, and then right subtree. For post-order traversal, first we visit the left subtree, then right subtree, and then root. You can see here, left subtree is always traversed before the right subtree. The difference among the algorithm is the time at which the root is processed. In pre-order algorithm, root is processed before the left and right subtree. In in-order algorithm, root is processed in between left and right subtree. And in post-order algorithm, root is processed after the subtrees are traversed. Next, we learn how to traverse a binary tree using pre-order, in-order, and post-order traversal. First, we learn pre-order traversal. In pre-order, first we visit the root, then traverse the left subtree in pre-order, and then traverse the right subtree in pre-order. Consider this is a binary tree. Now, we traverse it using pre-order traversal. To traverse a tree in pre-order, we need to apply these three steps in each node. So, let's start it. First, visit the root node. Root node of this tree is A. Node A is visited. Next step is traverse the left subtree in pre-order. Left subtree of A is this. Now, we apply these three steps on this part. First one is visit the root. Root of this subtree is B. So, visit or process it. B is processed. Then, traverse the left subtree in pre-order. Left subtree of B is D. Now process it using pre-order algorithm. It's just a function call. We call here the pre-order function and we go here. Visit the root. Root of this subtree is D. So D is visited. Now traverse the left subtree in pre-order. D has no left subtree. Then traverse the right subtree in pre-order. D has no right subtree also. So go back to B. Left subtree of B is traversed. Now apply this step. Traverse right subtree in pre-order. Right subtree of B is this one. Now apply these three steps on this part. First visit the root. The root of this subtree is E. E is visited. Then traverse the left subtree in pre-order. Left subtree of E is G. Now apply these three steps on G. Visit the root. Root of this subtree is G. So, G is visited. G has no left and right subtree. So, left subtree of A is traversed. Now, we traverse the right subtree of A. Right subtree of A is this one. Visit the root. Root of this subtree is C. C is visited. Now, traverse the left subtree in pre-order. C has no left subtree. So, go to the next step. Traverse right subtree in pre-order. Right subtree of C is this one. Now, apply these three steps on this part. Visit the root. Root of this subtree is F. F is visited. Traverse the left subtree in pre-order. 
left subtree of f is h. Now we traverse it using pre-order algorithm. The first step of pre-order algorithm is visit the root. Root of this subtree is h. So h is visited. And it has no left and right subtree. So go back to f. Left subtree of f is traversed. Now we traverse the right subtree of f. This is the right subtree of f. And i is visited. So this is the sequence after traversing this tree in pre-order. Next we learn the in-order traversal. In in-order traversal, first we traverse the left subtree in in-order, then process the root, and then traverse the right subtree in in-order. Let's traverse this binary tree using in-order traversal. Root node is A, so we traverse the left subtree of A. Left subtree of A is this one. Now apply these three steps on this part. First traverse the left subtree in in order. Left subtree of B is D. Now traverse the left subtree of D in in order. D has no left subtree. Go to the next step. Process the root. D is processed. Then go to the next step. Traverse the right subtree in in order. D has no right subtree. So go back to B. Left subtree of B is processed. Now process the root, V is traversed, go to the next step, traverse the right subtree in in order. Right subtree of B is this part, now apply this three step on this part. Traverse the left subtree in in order, left subtree of E is G, traverse the left subtree of G, G has no left subtree. Next step is process the root, G is traversed, then go to the next step. Traverse the right subtree in in order. G has no right subtree. So go back to E. Left subtree of G is traversed. Now we traverse the root node that is E. You can see here left subtree of A is processed. The next step is process the root. A is processed. Now we traverse the right subtree of A in in order. The root of this subtree is C. Traverse the left subtree of C. C has no left subtree. Then process the root. C is processed. Then traverse the right subtree in in order. This is the right subtree of C. Here we apply this three step. Traverse the left subtree in in order. Left subtree of F is H. H has no left subtree and no right subtree. So we process it. Then we process the root, that is F. Then we process the right subtree, that is I. So this is the order after traversing this tree in in order. Next we learn the post order traversal. In post order, first we traverse the left subtree in post order, then traverse the right subtree in post order, and then process the root. The root of this tree is A. So we traverse the left subtree of A. This is the left subtree of A. The root of this subtree is B. So we traverse the left subtree of B. Left subtree of B is D. And D has no left and right subtree. So we process it. Now D is processed. The left subtree of B is processed. Next step is process the right subtree in post order. Right subtree of B is this one. Now apply these three steps on this part. First step is traverse the left subtree in post order. The left subtree of E is G. Now apply these three steps on G. Traverse the left subtree in post order. G has no left subtree. Go to the next step. Traverse the right subtree in post order. It has no right subtree also. Go to the next step. Process the root. So we processed here G. Now go back to E. Left subtree of E is processed. Next we traverse the right subtree of E in post order. E has no right subtree, so we process the root. E is processed. Now back to B. Left subtree of B is processed. Right subtree of B is also processed. Now we process the root. B is processed. Now you can see here 
left safety of A is processed. Now we traverse the right safety of A in first order. This is the right safety of A and the root node of this safety is C. Traverse the left safety in first order. C has no left safety. Go to the next step. Traverse the right safety in first order. This is the right safety of C. The root of this safety is F. Here we apply these three steps. Traverse the left safety in first order. Left safety of F is H. Now traverse the left safety of H. H has no left safety. Then traverse the right safety of H. It has no right safety also. Then process the root. So H is processed. Go back to F. Left safety of F is processed. Now process the right safety of F. Right safety of F is I. And I has no left and right safety. So process it. I is processed. Left and right safety of F is processed. Now process the root. Then process C. You can see here both left and right safety of A is processed. Now we process the root node that is A. So this is the sequence after traversing this tree in post order traversal. This was about pre order, in order and post order traversal. Hope you understand. Next tutorial we learn how to write code for pre order, in order and post order traversal. In my description section, I put the link of my next video. Please check it.